The championship is on the line. And it will be strictly a fight to the finish. It will have to be decided. A disqualification doesn't mean anything. Well, Bulldog, this is mayhem. This is the match that you've been trying to talk to me for about a week now. This is the match that you said the British Bulldogs are going to breeze through. This is the match you said they're going to lose their titles. Now, I'm going to sit side by side with you, Ed Whelan, and when the smoke clears the ring, you'll see the, the Cuban commandos wearing those belts. I think the British Bulldogs has been overrated for some time, and they yeah. haven't been meeting a lot of stiff competition. Now, nice you ever I... stop for a breath? You ever stop for a breath? I don't believe a word of what you're saying. You're watching the British Bulldogs, obviously, challenging for the International Tag Team Championship belts. They're in the ring at a combined rate of 476 pounds against the Cuban Commandos. 473 pounds, not much difference in weight. The Commandos consisting of the Cuban Assassin and Comrade Jerry Morrow. The Bulldogs, of course, Davy Boy Smith and the Dynamite Kid. A cage match. It has to be a fight to the finish. Disqualifications don't mean a single thing. Dynamite going after Jerry Morrow. And he grabs the strap from him while Davy Boy Smith tries to run the Cuban into the cage. And the Cuban decides not to cooperate. Good clothesline by Dynamite. It's a great combination, these Bulldogs. One, two, now only a two count there. I haven't seen a cage match in a long time. Well, you know, cage matches are very, very brittle. I'll tell you, they're made out of wire. They're parts of the cage of steel. And I'll tell you what, you get your head knocked up against those things. Hey, you'll see stars for some time. It's just a brutal match, but I like it because I'll tell you what, I come from where it's always brutal, you know, from the United States of America. And I'm going to tell you, I like the Cuban commandos. I know that your version's different. British Bulldogs is probably the greatest thing that you've ever saw. But believe me, Ed Whalen, they'll get the cookie tonight. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this. I'm surprised that an American would be in love with the Cubans. I don't think that's normal behavior for most Americans. That wasn't very nice of you to well, say Well, I'm just things. throwing that in. Look out! Watch this! Oh, bango! Caught him in the back on that cage! Meantime, Dynamite Kid is having his problems against the Cuban. David Boy Smith, the action heating up. You see what they have to resort to? They got a belt around his neck. If they're so great, and they're so wonderful the way you say it is. Why don't they go in there and wrestle these guys instead of using an illegal object? Well, it's a, I don't believe you, but the illegal object was brought in by the commandos. My dear sir, I want to recommend a certain optometrist to you. We'll do that after the fight. You are watching. Yes, you are. A steel cage match. For the international tag team belts, the champions, the Cuban commandos, the challengers, the British Bulldogs, and right now, the Cubans are up top on both sides, both counts. Well, you know, I've met the Cubans. I saw them wrestle right across the country. I have never did see them in easy matches. And lo and behold, here tonight, what do I see again? A big cage match, another brutal match. So I say, hey, yeah, they got their hands full. But the bottom line, Mr. Whalen, they are the champions. Well, that's true. But for how much longer? That is the question. The Bulldogs working. The Cuban in some problem areas in the corner. Driver coming up with dynamite. He dropped Morrow. 
Dynamite cannot run, or rather, Davy Boy cannot run the Cuban into that steel screen. There is no time limit on this thing. There are no rules, really. Five minutes, John. Five minutes. And we're at the five-minute mark, but knuckle dusters were being used by the Cuban on the leg of Davy Boy. Well, uh, Ed, what match are you watching? I haven't saw no brass uh, knuckles. I'm talking about your optometrist. You got a problem, Buster. Where's he going? Is he trying to get out of here? I think he's trying to get out of here. Oh, no. Oh, look at this. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Head butt. Has he got him? Oh, Morrow. Morrow dropping from the top. Meanwhile, Davy Boy was getting bulldogged on the far side. The dynamite kid seriously hurt. He dived off the top rope, and he hit that hard body of Jerry Morrow. That's like cement anyways. He's hurt, and if Jerry gets up, he can take an advantage of it. the titles. I'm sure the British Bulldogs did something